Hello everyone, it is the Feral Daryl that plays and welcome back to another Timmy video. So Timmy is now released for free and is no longer in beta because it is now free and not cost Robux. So now I'm going to teach you guys how to play Timmy and how to win every single time in Timmy. So without further ado, let's get straight into today's video. First, I will be taking this in the slowest approach ever, going very, very slow, teaching you guys everything that you need to know about Timmy. So you first spawn in this cul-de-sac right here, and there's nothing really here. There is the like rewards right here. Once the game hits a certain number of likes, everyone gets a certain reward, but that hasn't happened yet. So let's look at this. This is... The update board, which we will be talking about later, and these three buttons on the side, this one is the shop where we can buy crates. For example, let's buy a starter crate right now. These are all the things that we can get from it. Let's see, 4% chance of legendary. Let's see what rarity Timmy I get. So instead of pets, there are things called Timmy's, which is what I'm spinning for here. And I got a common mime Timmy. So, okay, that's okay. I don't have that yet. Um, so the shop is so many things. It has the normal currencies the gold, and it has these things as well, the QEs. So the QEs are another different type of a um, currency that we can get in the game, and they both do different things. So with the, a the QEs, we can buy these skins right here. There are also game passes for Robux. The shop has all kinds of cool things as well. So there are weapons in this game as well. And there are also abilities. So the abilities we can use every single game. To me, the best one is the sprint. Just because you gain a speed boost for three seconds. That makes all the difference in the world. Okay, this button is trading in case you want to trade with people. And right here is the season one pass. So this button on the bottom of the screen is like our inventory. It's called the Wayfinder. It shows what time it is. Currently it's 346 for me. And here's my inventory right here of the Timmy's that I have. I know I don't have very many. This Timmy right here, 2015 Timmy. Oh wait, no, this one's my highest level one. Um, okay, next we have the monsters. The gold. I have the golden retriever and the normal goop. Uh, abilities, which we talked about a minute ago, and weapons. So that is our inventory right there. Next is our profile. So we have different badges right here, and we can also unlock a new tag. Right now I am a newbie because I haven't played too much. And right here are the quests. So there are daily quests and weekly quests for us to earn coins in AI. Uh, AQ. So let's go to the group rewards right now. It is in the Happy Chicken Diner over here. This is where we get free rewards if we're in the Wonderwork Studio group. So let's check it out right now and see what the reward is this week. So it resets once a week, I believe. So I got double player XP. So it lasts for six matches. That's great. So that school bus is how you get to the game. So we got to board this school bus right here for us to get to the game. So let's go ahead and get boarded on the school bus. So now we have to vote which episode to play. There's only one episode currently out right now. So everyone just has to vote them all. Next up, the AI or the player. So the AI's goal is, I'm going to choose the AI, hopefully I be it. The AI's goal is to kill every player before the time runs out. And the player's goal is to actually beat the game and get out of the mall before it's too late, before the monster kills you. So there are different tasks you can do, and there are two different ways to win. One, by cracking open the toy store wall, which I'll explain in a minute. And the second way to win as a player is to bust open the GameStop door. So... To go through the toy store wall, you'll need two different items, the crowbar and the dynamite. So that's fairly easy because there's only two items that you need. So two of your teammates, well, you and one of your teammates has to hold those two items so that you can win the game. Next up, the GameStop door. To enter it is... Yeah, 
you need the red key, the crowbar, and the key card. So that is a little bit more. So right now, we are playing, and we just started a match. So what we need to do first is try and find an open room, grab a tool off of any desk or area. It looks like this one's been taken already so that we can start fixing things. So basically, once we fix things, that is our way to get better and better at the game and finish up and actually try to escape. So we're going to look for an item. Looks like all my teammates have taken all of them already. That's a little bit unfortunate. Hopefully, they won't die with them. Uh, is there one here? No. Wow, okay. So my teammates took everything already. Uh, now we just have to be careful and cautious of the monster. There's the monster right there. Let's try and let's see. Where should we go? Maybe we go upstairs. Is that the monster? No. Okay. So let's try and go upstairs right now. Hopefully we can go. Okay. So let's see what rooms are open. This really matters to see. Okay. So we have the red key and it says lumber store. So now we're going to find the lumber store so that we can open the door and get another tool. This is basically how the game works. You have to get a new tool over and over and every time you get a new tool you have a greater chance at getting the tool that you actually need. For example we need the crowbar and the dynamite to beat the game by getting the toy store wall and we need the red key, the crowbar, and the key card for the GameStop door. So those are the two different ways to win this game. I'm trying to find it right now. Uh, the Lumberjack store. Here it is, Lumber store. So I'm opening the door with the key that I got. Now we have another thing. So this is the saw. Okay, so based on what I remember, the saw goes to fix the wall. So what is this right here? Uh, a key. Let's actually grab this. A uh, game store. Okay, so the game store. We have to find the game store. Not exactly sure where the game store is. Uh, based on my memory, I believe the game store is uh, downstairs, I think. Okay, so let's try and get back downstairs. Here's an elevator right here. And let's go back down. Also, we have two lives. Oh, the exit is open. Escape now. Okay, so it looks like my teammates have done it already. Uh, the exit uh, the exit is open, so that's where we have to go right now. I know I just fell, wasted a life. That's okay, though, because we are going to make it to the end without losing. So 40 seconds left. All I got to do is make it to the exit. Looks like all of my teammates already were good teammates and did everything that I needed to do for me. So we exited. Yes, we did it. So we won the game. Well done team. So that is a perfect way to start the video and show you guys how to play Timmy. This is pretty awesome. We got 94 XP and 70 coins. So we are a normal player again in a brand new round. Yes, I know. I really wanted to try and be the AI at least once, but the AI is very self-explanatory. All you have to do as the AI is kill all of the players. It is very simple and it's not too hard, I'd say. It is probably the easiest thing to do in the game. This one requires some strategy being the player and actually trying to get around. But okay, so the monsters spawn right now. So we don't really want to be in the area. Yep, there's a monster already. And we lost a life already. Okay, that's not very good. I'm not playing that well this round. Uh, but I don't really want to be here anyway because all I'm trying to do is be the AI. So it looks like he's cornering me in this room. That's pretty annoying. Well, um, I'm probably gonna die here. Okay. Wow, we actually just really juked him right there. That was awesome. So next we gotta find the clothing store so that we can just completely finish these tasks. And by finishing these tasks is super easy for us. Is this a clothing store? Oh my gosh, yeah, how lucky are we? This key goes to the lumber store, which happens to be right across the hallway right here. So lucky for us, we are just trying to complete as many tasks as we can so that we can get the right tools to exit the game. And if we exit the game, that is how we win the game as the player. Next up is the game store. Okay, so the game store, I believe, is downstairs which we went to a minute ago. Oh, there's the AI right there. So I kind of want to run away from him 
so that I don't lose. Okay, let's go down the elevator. Oh, elevator's not fixed. Okay, so that means I just have to go down the stairs. Okay, that's fine with me. Let's go back down the stairs and go to the game store. So this is the red key. Now we just have to look for the red box, which it goes to, which I believe is... Oh, okay, we did get killed. That's okay, though. I don't really mind. Um, hopefully our teammates can carry and win the game. But basically, we already beat the game once in Timmy, and that is about all that you need to know about Timmy. So thank you guys so much for watching this video today. I sure hope you guys learned a lot about the new Roblox game, Timmy, which is now free. So if you haven't already, check out the game in Roblox. Play the game. It is so much fun, and I promise you, you will not get bored. This has been one of my favorite newer games recently, and it has been so exciting to play. So thank you you so much for watching. This has been the Feral Daryl that plays. Goodbye.